Hey everybody! So this is day number 13 and it was Sunday so I did nothing. Except for homework and sleep in and keep reading this book. I've decided I'm obsessed. I'm like halfway through it. I've been pacing myself actually, like taking breaks from reading it, but it's so good. It is so good. I love it. There are just so many things that they put in there. Like the main character means Casanova. Casanova is a character in this book as a reincarnated like animal. It makes me so excited to see all these references. I love it. I love it. But yeah. Currently, the main character is a guinea pig. Better than an ant or a worm, you know? So. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I did pretty much nothing today. I basically had a very chill day with the cats. Sushi and Ninja. They're so cute. Give them D2, but she's not in the room right now. Um, But I start my actual schedule tomorrow. So that's good. Um, I decided to take the ancient history class and the um, art history archaeology class, so it's gonna be fun. It's gonna, it's gonna be, it's gonna be nerve-wracking, actually, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> uh, the TDs are basically oral presentations. I have to do a presentation on the topography of ancient Vienna and why it matters and why Vienna was an important city to the ancient Romans. And then for my ancient history I have to talk about Macedonia in front of everybody with my American French. <laughs> but it's not until March and then from March on I just sit and take notes. So it'll be fine hopefully also February vacations are a thing I'm thinking I might go to Nîmes which is this really really cool uh, town where there's a lot of ancient Roman architecture and activities like they have a Colosseum they have a Colosseum I was there last year I want to go again there's this really cool park with all of these statues and this really great pond and then there's this hill you can walk up to and there's this tower you can go up and see basically everything in meme from there. I think that'd be cool. I think that'd be cool. And it's like eight euros to take a train from here to Nîmes. So why not? Why, why not? I'm gonna take a trip. Ah! <laughs> But yeah, I think it's going to be more like a day trip to just walk around and see the things. It'll make me happy. It'll make me happy. Yeah. That is basically what I'm up to. I'm going to go and watch a movie with my host mom. It's going to have Ben Affleck in it and I'm excited. Um, it'll be nice to see him not wearing the Batman costume thing. The only other movie I know him from is um, Argo, which is a fantastic movie. If you haven't seen it, go watch it. It's... I love it. I love it. Um, but I'm a nut for those history-filled political movies, or just action movies in general. I love Die Hard. And movies like that are so cool. They're so cool. Ah. But yeah. I'm gonna go watch a movie and it's gonna be great. I'm going to then go to sleep. Don't have classes tomorrow morning. I will have classes in I have one class tomorrow in the afternoon. And then on Tuesday I only have one class. No. I have two classes. They're in the afternoon. Wednesday I have one class at night. <laughs> what am I gonna do with myself? What am I gonna do with myself? Uh, let's see, Thursday, I only have one class in the af in, at night. And then Friday, I have three classes, but I'll be done by three. 
What am I going to do with myself? Oh, update. I found a really cool uh, volunteer opportunity that I can do. I'm going to go in and help this uh, French high school student uh, who has been in the hospital. Um, but it's her year to take the Bach. And for those of you who don't know, the Bach is like the SAT of the French, but way more important and way more difficult. Um, basically, with if you pass your Bach, you can get into any college. Any college. Um, except for Les Grandes Écoles, which is like the Ivy League of France. Uh, therefore, if you, like, ace your box, um, and you want to go into, like, politics or something crazy, it, it's for, like, those really, really dedicated people. All of the modern politics went to a grand école for politics. Um, so, yeah, that's how the French system works. So she's trying to learn English and wants to take the English box. So I'm going to help her with that, because I'm a native English speaker. So that'll be cool. I'll get to go and visit her in the hospital and help her with her English and all that kind of jazz. Uh, so that she can hopefully pass her baccalaureate, because... <sighs> Guys, it is so common to not pass the back. It's so disheartening, almost. But there are people who will take it three times, and you can only take it three times and still fail. So you have to figure out something else to do. It's intense. It's intense. The SAT you can just keep taking until you just finally get better. Uh, not so with the back. At least that's what I understood. I could be wrong. Maybe I misheard my host mom. Google it. Don't trust me, trust the internet, because the internet is always correct. No. <laughs> uh, but seriously, if you find a reliable website and you figure out how many times you can take the back or if it's unlimited or whatever, comment it so I know, because I am here to learn. But yeah, that's what I'm doing, and that's what's been going on, and I shall see y'all tomorrow. Night-night!